Hi guys, so I don't know why I'm still whispering. I just filmed an ASMR video, so I'm still in ASMR mode. Um, I am back from vacation, so this is the first video I'm really filming since vacation other than the ASMR one I just filmed. And I just feel like I wanted to come on here and rant, give you a little update, what's going on. We have little Miss Noonie, who does not like being picked up. Um, <laughs> Uh, so I just thought I would come on here and give you guys a little update on what's going on. So, today is September 30? No, September, August. What? Where is my mind? What is the date even today? It is August 31st. Goodness. I got back on the 29th and the day we got back, actually I got back on the 28th because it was supposed to rain the 29th so we came back early. What is happening? Um, and we moved my sister in, so my sister moved out, uh, with her boyfriend, and we were moving her into her apartment, and that's obviously still going on, that's not like a one-day thing, um, she's pretty close still, so, um, we've just been getting trip, bleh, we've been taking small trips and things, um, so we did that. The first day, we actually, I went with her just to drop off a couple of things before moving day, and we locked ourselves out of the apartment, yeah that happened um the out there's two doors to get into the apartment and the outer door locks behind you like when you just close it so we left the keys inside thinking oh we'll leave it unlocked the cars will go right there we can see the door from the car like we'll just be bringing stuff in and out um and the door locked behind us so that was a fun time but it was an interesting experience uh we had to get the person like the maintenance person to come unlock the door but we also met her new neighbor which she had already met at work that morning which was just like the biggest coincidence her neighbor is the nicest person i've ever met she's so sweet so um that was quite a fun time um on vacation uh it was really good we went to the beach the weather turned out to be really great i only got summered on the top of my feet this year guys if you remember last year that is what happened i got the worst summer of my life um so that was really bad but sorry if the camera's moving noonie is taking a bath underneath the tripod um right noonie and noonie girl oh and noonie girl um so the weather was good i only got somewhere on the top of my feet and that's pretty good a little bit of color which is nothing for most people but for me it's exciting um uh, my boyfriend came, Jimmy, which you guys only know him probably from Instagram. Um, so he came for the last couple of days, which was great. We went mini golfing, we went to the beach. Um, it was really nice. It was actually one of the first times we, like, we've been together for almost a year now, and it was one of the first times we hung out and we didn't watch any movies or anything. We always, almost always watch a movie together. Um, but I was exhausted. I fell asleep super early one night. Um, and we, I don't know, it was just, it was a really, really nice time. I got a lot of my boardwalk snacks I love to have. Um, we did go to the Jersey Shore, which is, uh, where I grew up going and stuff. It's only about an hour from where I live. Um, so that was great, and then I came back and visited Candice, which she's been on this channel before. Um, not in like a sit-down video, but she always would help me film my fashion videos, which I haven't done in a hot minute, so maybe I'll try to do one of those soon. Um, but she adopted a puppy, and his name is Bear, and I'll put some pictures in here. Um, he is the cutest puppy in the whole world. I'm obsessed with him. I love him. I've already offered to babysit. I think I'm going to do that this weekend. Um, he is about 12 weeks old. And he is a mini doodle and golden doodle mix. I can't remember. But um, he's only going to get up to 25 pounds. Uh, he is just so well behaved. He already is playing fetch. He's so cuddly. Um, the second I met him, he was like really liking me. I don't know if it's because I smell like cats or what. But um, I am obsessed with him. I literally didn't want to leave. I was only supposed to stop by to meet him. And I stayed for like two hours because I just could not pull myself away. He fell asleep on my lap. Um, oh, I'm so obsessed with him. I could talk about him forever. Um, while I'm sitting here petting Noonie, and he actually looks like my cats because he's black with like white on his neck and he has little white feet. It's really funny. Um, but I'm really excited to be an uh, auntie of a new little puppy. Um, what else has been going on? I've been breaking out like crazy. Don't know if you can see. I tried to do something with the light so it wouldn't be so obvious. Um, I'm breaking out really bad. I think the water down the shore is different than here. It's like hard water or soft water. And I almost always break out when I'm on vacation. So I know that has something to do with it. But now I've been home for like four days. And no, three days? Friday, Saturday, Sunday, today's Monday. Oh, four, today's the fourth day. And I'm still breaking out. I am healing about a lot of the spots. But like I'm not just breaking out where I wear a mask. 
Um, it's like all over my forehead's getting bad. Um, I know I haven't been eating that great. I ate a lot of fried food on vacation. That could have something to do with it too. But usually fried food doesn't get me too much. Usually it's like candy and too much sugar. Um, so that's been a big old bummer. Um, the biggest part that's bothering me actually is the cystic breakouts. I had one on the side of my nose. You can see the red spot from that. Um, and right now I have one over here by my brow. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that. Um, but it's really bad. It's painful. Like, just talking hurts. Um, it's really, really bad. I couldn't sleep on the side. I haven't had a cystic breakout like this in so long. It is so painful. Um, I'm going to have to ice it later and do my cystic acne overnight treatment that I shared with you guys years ago. Um, I am so annoyed. And I know this sounds so, like, I hate to be this person. But at the same time, like, I dealt with acne for um, over 10 years. That was so bad. It was painful. I didn't want to not wear makeup to leave my room. Like, I didn't want my family to see me without makeup. I wore makeup everywhere. Um, I was so insecure about my skin. I would look in the mirror and just cry. I've done a video about acne um, and how it really eats away at your self-esteem. And it just really freaking sucks. And at the same time as all of that, it is normal. It's a normal thing that happens. It doesn't mean there's anything wrong with you. It doesn't mean that you're doing something wrong i mean it can i mean it can mean that like you're not cleaning your face well enough or using the right products for your skin or eating healthy like it can mean these things but like even so you can do everything right and still have acne which is what i'm doing i have the same routine that i had a few months ago my skin was almost perfectly clear um and it's just really bothering me and i think for me it just it brings back all those insecurities i've had for a very long time um, so I'm just feeling a bit down about that. I almost didn't even film today and I would have had no video going up this week, um, which would have been like a real bummer for me. I only missed one week, I think, a couple weeks ago during like, uh, the like height of the quarantine when I was feeling really stressed and stuff like that. So, um, and like when Bert broke his hip and everything. So I didn't want to miss another upload so I came on and did this without makeup um I don't want to put makeup on when I'm breaking out like this um that is a thing that has at least changed with me is that when I had breakouts back then I had to wear makeup like I would not leave my room without makeup like I said um but now I like don't want to wear makeup unless I'm like actually going somewhere like I'm gonna be photographed and like stuff like that um but like I'm gonna run to the post office later I'm not putting makeup on when I'm breaking out, I just want my skin to breathe and like and use any treatments I want to use. Um, I even put a clay mask, a charcoal clay mask on last night. I haven't worn a face mask for acne in like a thousand years, like so long, um, because I just haven't needed it. And I just usually will use masks in like specific areas and stuff. And I had to do that, and it just felt like I was going back in time. Um, but other than the acne things are going pretty good. Bert is almost totally healed. His hair hasn't fully grown, grown back yet where his surgery was, um, but he's barely limping anymore. He's very vocal though, so that's fun. Um, Binx is just as crazy as ever, and Noonie will be moving in with Kim soon, so she will not be in videos or anything as much as normal, um, but she's here for now. They're gonna finish getting settled and everything before they uh, move her into the apartment. Um, what else, what else? Okay, so September 7th is my one-year anniversary with Jimmy, so that's very exciting. Um, it was, it's our one-year anniversary of meeting, not him asking me out. Um, it was an easier date to remember September 7th than the date he actually asked me out, so that's what we'll be celebrating. Um, it's actually on Labor Day, so, um, he is off of work, so we get to do something, which is exciting. And I think that's really all I have to catch you up on, so, hope you enjoyed <laughs> this video. And, uh... Let me know what videos you want to see from me soon. I'm really struggling coming up with ideas. So let me know in a comment what kind of things you guys want to see coming up. More ASMR. I know you guys really love that. Um, or, you know, makeup or fashion. I know I'm way overdue for a fashion video. I'm really thinking of, you know, whether I want to do an outfit of the week or, you know, a fall lookbook. I feel like it's going to be hard to do outfit stuff right now just because, like, who the heck is wearing real clothes? <laughs> like... We're not still not like doing much or going anywhere so like i don't know if you guys would even want to see that um but just let me know and i'll see you next time thank you so much for watching Bye bye